What's up guys, how's it going? This is iPhones and iPods. And um, right now I have a pretty quick video for you guys. More, of, It's more about information, not as much tutorial. And it's about the second gen iPod Touch Joe Break and um, the 3.0 beta firmware for your iPhone or iPod Touch. And so uh, first off, I'll start off with um, the second generation Joe Break. Um, as many of you all probably know, there was a, uh, the dev team released it's something called Final Snow, and it's the, uh, Quick Pwn tool, or it's the, it's the new easiest tool to, um, jailbreak your, your second generation iPod Touch untethered also. And, um, as most of you probably know, I do not have a iPod Touch second generation, I just have an iPhone. So, for obvious reasons, I can't show you guys how to do that. So, um, in the link in the description, I provided a, uh, a video, and it's from BB's iPod Touch Help, and he does a great job, and he just, it was just released today, he just released this video, and it's a great step-by-step -step tutorial for all you second-gen users, and, uh, you definitely should go check it out, and that's, that's probably the best video on how to jailbreak your second-gen iPod Touch untethered the easiest way. So definitely go check out that link for the jailbreak. And um, the second thing I want to talk about is the 3.0 firmware. Now, as many of you probably know, I have a copy of it. I don't. Ha I'm not running it right now, but I do have a copy of it because I'm not running it right now because I have my jailbroken. But um, they did just release the beta 2 firmware, which I have also gotten a copy of, and it is jailbreakable. And I was just wondering if you guys wanted a video on that. And the reason I ask is because a lot of people have decided not to post videos on it because of the dangers. Example, yellow snow never being able to be used. And uh, some other things. And it's beta and it's kind of lagging stuff. And also not very many people have it. It's be um, mainly because you have to uh, get a developer to enter your iPhone's UDID so that you can um, authorize the firmware or else it probably won't work for you you probably won't be able to run it so that's why some people have probably for instance Will DTA he posted a whole video on why he's not going to so um, since that many people are doing it I was wondering if you guys maybe wanted me to post a video on it because it's not that hard but you do have the hard part is getting a copy of the 3.0 beta firmware and um, that you just have to get a developer or some people have eBay um, auctions going on selling spots for your iPhone or iPod Touch to be entered into their developer account so they can enter your UDID into their um, system and then you can um, activate the firmware. And obviously there are some cool features of it but um, those are just two things I want you guys to know about. Um, more importantly, the uh, second gen iPod Touch show break, but also if you guys want a 3.0 beta 2, beta 2, not the first one, beta 2 firmware show break, just um, leave a comment. I want to see if it's actually worth doing. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Um